welcome everybody. My name is Bill Krantz. I'm the principal at Chihuahua Middle School. One of the perks that I get uh, as the principal is to be able to say thank you to really nice folks who do a tremendous uh, kindness to us. Um, in this instance, it's the good folks from Wells Fargo through Grand United Way um, hooking us up in the parlance of our students with Reading Plus program. Um, for us, it's a big deal. Uh, we had it and then it went away briefly and uh, we went into a deep fit of depression and then we recovered <laughs> um, because the kind folks at Wells Fargo uh, made it so that not only can we get it for our reading, reading program, our, our specific intervention classes, we can get it for the entire school. Um, and just for general information, it's a program that every single kid can make use of and it isn't just to try to get kids caught up. Um, it's also for uh, students to go beyond whatever grade they're in, and we have a number of examples of students that are well into high school with their reading levels. So we can't thank uh, the good folks from Wells Fargo and Grand United Way enough. Uh, it's just a really special gift, and we appreciate it. And without further ado, I'm going to introduce uh, the President and CEO of Grand United Way, Patrick Tufts. Uh, I'm going to be really brief. I, all I want to talk about, especially for the young people in the room, is the importance of relationships. How important good relationships are. The friendships you make now, the friendships you take into high school, the friendships you take out into the community are going to allow you to do great things. And because United Way has great relationships with lots of different organizations, we have great relationships with schools, we have great relationships with elected officials. We have great relationships with companies who want to make sure that our kids are learning to the best of your ability and are willing to help. And when you connect those good relationships together, we can do great things. And that's really what United Way has always meant to me, is we're able to connect people who want to do great things. So I'm here today, I'm only going to talk for one minute, but I'm here to thank the young people in the room for all the great work that you do here at school, to thank our teachers and administrators for all the wonderful work you do with our kids. You make it easy for us to partner with you because we see the great work that you're doing here in our schools. And I want to thank Wells Fargo for making this really big investment to allow us all to learn and us all to get better. So I'm going to stop there and I'm going to turn it over to the mayor of the great city of Manchester, Mayor Craig. Thank you. start my day with you and I just want to say thank you as well to the Granite United Way and to Wells Fargo for providing this program for now all of our middle school students. So I took a few minutes and I talked to all of you before uh, I had the opportunity to speak right now and it was great to hear firsthand what you loved about this program, how you loved the stories, you liked the vocabulary, the questions after, that you could make this program go at the pace that you wanted to and it could even challenge you more than I ready, which I love to hear. So it's really exciting for me to see how, how excited you are about this program and now to know that thanks to the Granite United Way and Wells Fargo, all of our middle school students will benefit from this. So I can't thank you enough and I really thank all of you um, and I hope that you have a great day. So you have a long line of speakers today. My name is Meredith Young and I have the privilege of talking about Reading Plus for the last um, eight years. I've been dreaming about a day like today. So about two years ago, we got to do this with Parkside Middle School. Parkside Middle School at the time was the poorest performing middle school in Reading in, in the city. And we said, what would it be like for every single kid at Parkside to get to use Reading Plus? What would happen? What would change? Um, 600 kids got involved, and a year later, Parkside went from the poorest performing middle school to the top performing middle school in the city. Now, Principal Krantz has already promised me that record will not stand. That uh, the McLaughlin's headed that way. I love my students are already fired up about this. But uh, I really want to say this to Patrick's point about relationships and scalable change. Um, when we said to Wells Fargo, look what happened at Parkside, they said that's great, but that's not good enough. Dream big and tell us what was next. And we said, what would it be like for every single kid to get to do this? And honestly, we've been waiting to do this for a long time in this city, to have every single kid in middle school put 
pushing their reading abilities and growing, and we are so grateful to our partnerships at the school, um, to the students here, and to our friends at Wells Fargo for making this happen today. Um, I, the Parkside kids already know to watch their back because you guys are coming for them, and we're really <laughs> excited about that. But this wouldn't happen with our, without our partners at Wells Fargo, and so a huge thank you and uh, to welcome um, to, to join us, uh, Dan O'Connor. Dan is the Senior Vice President at Wells Fargo here in Manchester. He also is a Central High alum, um, but I do want to warn you, the other school involved with this is Hillside, and he's also a Hillside alum, so we're going to shake it up a little bit and bring him. Dan, thank you so much to you and your team for making this happen for our kids. Come on up. and thanks for having us here. Uh, on behalf of Wells Fargo, I'm proud to be here uh, to celebrate the launch of the Reading Plus program. I'm Dan O'Connor, and I'm a Senior Vice President for Wells Fargo Commercial Banking in Northern New England here in Manchester. Um, like Meredith said, I'm, I grew up in Manchester. I raised my family here in Manchester. Uh, I'm a graduate of Smith Road, Hillside, and Central. Um, so I am, I am local. As part of our work, Wells Fargo strives to create a positive impact in the community, you know, where, where we are. And education is one of the key areas that Wells Fargo supports. We think that the Reading Plus program can make a real difference in the Manchester schools. Amongst the strongest predictors of on-time high school graduation and college completion are reading skills, comprehension, and vocabulary. With this in mind, Wells Fargo began discussions with the Granite United Way to see how we could come together to address a critical challenge in Manchester. We learned that the Reading Plus program, uh, we learned about the Reading Plus program and the success students at Parkside have had and the impact that this would have for all the middle school students in Manchester. So Wells Fargo was very glad to get involved. What we did is we uh, got together the donation so now the program can be in McLaughlin, Parkside, Southside, and Hillside. So I'm very happy to present this grant for $105,000 to the Granite United Way to ensure that the Manchester students, teachers, and schools have access to this important literacy program. So I'm proud to be here on behalf of Wells Fargo supporting the students of Manchester. We want you to do well in school. We want you to do well in life. And you are the future of our city. So thank you very much. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking this one. Yeah. <laughs> 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 